Hi, I'm Jem Stapleton. I'm a reader in computer science at the University of Brighton. Uh, my research is in the area of visual languages and I work to make complex mathematical ideas accessible by using diagrams instead of symbols. I work to develop theoretical underpinnings for automated Euler diagram drawing methods. Leonhard Euler was a pioneering Swiss mathematician and physicist in the 18th century. He made important discoveries in fields as diverse as infinitesimal calculus and graph theory. An Euler diagram is a visual means of representing sets and their relationships. Although he carried out this work centuries ago, it has only been since the mid-90s that diagrams have been taken seriously as an alternative to formal maths notations. Euler's diagrams have been influential in my work to create ways to communicate complex data in a visual way. Researchers at the University of Brighton have been leading pioneers in this area of visual modelling. There are two ways in which my research has been used. Firstly, by people who have data that they wish to visualise, and secondly, by people who wish to produce visualisations that capture properties of data. At the forefront of this is my work on developing applications and software with Nokia. You may not realise it, but when you use apps on your phone, you send data back to your service provider and phone manufacturer, but whether they are allowed to use it is a different matter. Nokia develops and uses my work in order to model privacy issues. I work with them to develop ethical visualisations to ensure the way they collect data is used in a way that's lawful. I'm Dr Ian Oliver. I'm the Privacy Engineer in Nokia's Location and Commerce Division. I'm responsible for the solutions, tools and techniques for supporting consumer privacy in our information systems. Gemma and her team at the University of Brighton have actively changed the way in which people at Nokia communicate, address problems and ultimately generate solutions together. This has significantly reduced development times, reduced errors in system specification communication and ultimately benefited the end consumer in a quality product. The other work I do is helping to develop software that supports the use of diagrams in collaboration with Dr Beryl Plimmer at the University of Auckland in New Zealand. My research area is human-computer interaction with a focus on touch and styles interaction. I collaborate with Jim Stoughton from the University of Brighton to create software tools for drawing logic diagrams. This makes for a mutually beneficial collaboration with Jim's knowledge of visual languages, helping my team to develop tools that are truly fit for purpose. Cambridge University has also been using quite a few strands of my work. This includes using my diagrams in their work on theorem proving. Primarily, I have been collaborating with Dr. Matea Yamnik, who is a senior lecturer in the computer laboratory at the University of Cambridge. So, Jen's expertise in developing logics for diagrams has been invaluable in my research into how to model human reasoning on machines. The cutting edge research that I've undertaken with Dr. Plimmer and Dr. Yamnik provides an important component of my research with Nokia. This whole portfolio of work undertaken at the University of Brighton demonstrates the important and significant impact that academic research can have in industry.